The sailors who we just saw love the wind, but it's a nuisance for folks in Napomo and Oceano. This year, state officials are doing something different to reduce the pollution that blows in from the dunes nearby. News Channel 3's Ophelia Young joins us live from Oceano Beach. And Ophelia, what are they doing out there? Yes, yeah, CJ, it would have been too dangerous for me to bring this live shot to the fences at the dunes, but I wanted to give you an idea of what it looks like. It looks like this fencing project that you're looking at right here, but way larger. State Parks gave me a tour earlier today. Kind of wider. Make my viewers queasy. <laughs> Deep in the dunes riding area. <laughs> What's that? So that's the project. We're going to go over and take a look at it. That kind of gives you an idea of the size and scale and scope of what we're doing. 15 acres of these orange fences right in the path of the wind. So this project is going to be reducing the particulate matter that gets airborne to help our downwind neighbors. Neighbors in Oceano and Napomo who are worried the wind causes sand pollution in their air. State parks worked together with international sand and dune experts and came up with this solution. And as a prevailing wind comes on to this project site, this wind fence is going to slow the wind down from the ground, on the ground speed wind, and it's going to drop the particulate out as it continues upwind onto the mesa. On the mesa? This is just, it's just full of sand. The neighbors have their doubts. Many say the only way pollution can be stopped is if RV activity in the dunes were stopped. But Barbara is hopeful. I hope it works, that it's not going to be uh, as bad. I mean, anything will help. She's looking forward to the results, and state parks will be tracking that progress. Putting in some uh, scientific equipment here downwind of the project, and then some equipment upwind of it. Brent is confident this huge $1 million project will make a difference. It's something of this size and scale and scope is, uh, is, is yeah, it's, it's unprecedented. So those sand fences will only stay up till July. That's when windy season ends. If the project does well, they say they'll maybe talk about expanding it into the future. Live in Oceano, Ophelia Young, News Channel 3.